Today I have the Holiday Brilliant Light controller system and I'm going to show you how to hook this up. Alright, right here we see a picture of the whole setup and it shows the three remotes and the main control unit. Also the stakes to hold them in the ground and the music speaker. And how to plug them in. And this is basically the diagram that's on the box and how to hook it up. But I'll show you. And here is the remote command unit for it for when you're inside that you can use. This is receiver block number three, which I have just plugged into the wall outlet there for main power. And coming off of it, I have some uh, lights around the front as well as these big critters right here. I also have this tree and this snowman. I did that so I wouldn't have a cord running across the front steps. Now this tree here and this snowman here they are plugged into the main control box which I have right over here. And they are plugged into channel number two and channel number one is not being used off the main control box, it is being used remotely. Uh, channel three is going out into the field, I'll show you that, um, because I needed an extra channel out there. Because I have two channels out there already remotely controlled by this box. Because I used my third channel over around the side, I was minus one out front. So I had to uh, run another cord from the main control box. Now you can get extra control, uh, remote control boxes for out in the field, in the receivers that is, um, and in packs of three so you can have an extra three out there um, that run on the channels one, two, and three. So that's what we'll be picking up for next year so I can head them out there remotely and I won't have to run another uh, extension cord out. So as you can see the yellow one is channel three and it's going out to this set of lights on that tree out there. It's its own particular channel. Now what I've done here, this shrub right here, and this tree over and behind with the yellow cord on it, you can see that is channel one. Okay, I have that as channel one. And the main power line is the coming from the house is the orange cord there. Now I have the main power feed split off also to get to my secondary channel the remote right here because you need power obviously to the uh, to the remote boxes in order to feed them. And then of course over the top comes the uh, is the main power. No, the bottom comes your um, your tree lights. So I have this tree here which you'll see later lit up and the uh, toy soldier um, lit up with uh, that one down there that tree down there. I called them my pencil trees. You'll see why later. Those two trees and lights running off channel number two. So that's basically all I have done with the brilliant holiday lights this year because I just bought it this year. So, uh, so that's about it for now. Now I also have up in the window some other lights I'm going to show you. These are not on yet, but up top there we have Merry Christmas sign, we have Santa Claus with a candle in them that's animated, and we have lights that go around the perimeter of the bay window. Now those ones are uh, completely different. They operate themselves, so there's no worries, uh, no control units for them. They're operating independently. They're the color-changing LEDs.